There's the Pines Hawkins combination we've seen all night. breakdown but Rios to begin with maybe he could have handled that ball a little bit better Nashville pressing high with Belmar cool we done yeah able to knock that pass down Pilato plays it back for Loudon oh, lovely footwork by the center back now Loudon will go forward quick counter target, target there from uh, Matt Real I'll just try and work the goalkeeper bouncing in front of him warm his hands get him tested but that was never going to test any goalkeeper that was too far off target. Knocked up ahead. Here's Wild. Baizo. Through ball. Ryan is there. Goes down in the box. But it stays with Loudon winning it back. Lisa Ryan nearly won himself a penalty. Alvarez. All the way back to Hawkins. He picked up the captain's armband. And here we go. Again, an opportunity for... Going down the road in the USL. Now running forward is the center back, Harry Hawkins. Good find to Concord accumulation. Can Loudon string together another performance like they did on Wednesday? Now his seventh appearance overall, but has a goal to his name already this season. And Amo was a player on Wednesday that, that really felt like he should have gotten, gotten a goal on Wednesday against Birmingham. Fifth in crosses attempted in the Eastern Conference. And so some on the watch when he's stretching down the field and it should be a fun uh, battle 1v1 with Chester here this evening. Funny enough, Chester actually came off the bench as well in the previous matchup between these two as he meets up with Presley again. Ball whipped in, dangerous one, ball is free! Lennox just making a sixth appearance overall, so still getting that chemistry down, has one assist for the side. Got a goal in open cup play for New England. As this ball sent in, Alvarez back over, but it over! Work, Duvernay trying to help out North Carolina here, but it's stolen back. And for North Carolina, it's been this possession style, but they haven't been able to really play them but they're really shoring up some of those pockets that, that they might have seen North Carolina want to be dangerous in. And, and they're fascinating thing when you, when you watch these affiliated clubs with those, how they develop the youngsters. Uh, you're getting experience with them. Obviously, you always want to win games and you want to get three points, but developing these, these young players is very important to these affiliated clubs. Nyman chips a forward look for that punch Credit to Alvarez and Bustamante. They've been great in distribution, but as well on the defense been swarming there, keeping him padded down as a former player of the week. And that's a great point. Go Ball sent ahead, Hawkins all over it though, and sends it back up the field. Here's Lubon with a bit of room. Cut it back, didn't know the defender was there. I feel like you develop such a personal relationship with your players, but to call them all by their last name, like you're a broadcaster. Here's Presley. Arduino. Harry Hawkins out of the back. Hartford, Connecticut, as it remains nil-nil between Jimmy Nielsen and Tommy Soane's group. Hilton somehow got it away. Dakers keeps it in play. He's got Dewey beat for pace, but a heavy. In that game, then two goals in the span of three minutes. Don't forget they had someone sent off as well. Mm -hmm. So to make your way back into it shows character, especially at Slugger Field. Yeah, and a penalty that went their way, I think you could argue. It's a kind one. <laughs> 16th in the East out of 18 teams. Loudon has played so much better as this year has gone. Lost it to M. Kosana. And there's an odd man break here that's broken up for the Rowdies. And the run by Hawkins pushing and door forward. And door! Him. Game saving tackle one after another on that left hand side. And it's not just on the left, he's tracked back into the middle as well. It's what we'd like to play, unfortunately, with injuries, lack of depth, and guys coming in and out with DC United. We don't have the depth to be able to do it. 
Harry Hawkins out of the back. Sinclair again dropping extremely deep. Douay on the first time. Matt Real gets ahead to it, still dangerous.